All right, uh, let's look at the uh, homework 4.2, problem number 7. All right, so uh, let's look at this function, f of x equals negative 6 plus 2 natural log of x. All right, so the domain is, uh, because of the natural log, uh, we know that uh, we cannot have a, um, we have to have a positive value. So uh, it's going to be positive value, so uh, 0 to infinity. All right, so that was uh, pretty simple. All right. Uh, what is the y-intercept uh, for plug in 0? Actually, there is no y-intercept because uh, we cannot plug in x equals 0. Right? So we got that. Right? X-intercept. Right? So we're going to have to set that equal to 0. So let's do that. So we set this guy equal to 0. And let's solve. So I'm going to add 6 to both sides. So we get the 2 natural log of x is equal to 6. Then we can divide through by 2, so you have a natural log of x is equal to 3, right? Then we can, uh, you know, raise uh, e to the both sides. So e to the natural log of x is going to be x. Then you have e cubed, right? So x-intercept is e cubed, right? So let's see, um, e cubed, right? So check the answer. Right, we got that. And what is a local max and a local min? So let's uh, take the derivative. Right, so we need to take the derivative of this guy. Right, derivative of negative six is zero, so I'm not going to write anything down. So it's a two, and derivative of natural log is one over x, so it's going to be two over x. Right. Then you can see that uh, there is no uh, critical number. Uh, because uh, if you set that equal, uh, this is never zero, right? Then this is undefined when x equals zero, but the function is not defined x equals zero. So we know that uh, there's no uh, maximum, right? So we got that. And uh, there's no minimum either, so we got that. Right? Then inflection points, right? So we need to take the derivative again. So f prime, double prime, of x. So this is the same thing as 2x to the negative 1. Right? So this is going to be, uh, if you take the derivative, so it's a negative 2x to the subtract 1 from the power. So it's negative 2 power, which is negative 2 over x squared. Right? This is actually always negative. So it's, uh, it's actually concave, uh, concave down all the time. Right, so inflection point. There's no inflection point because it's concave down all the time. Right, and uh, SP is increasing, decreasing. So let's look at that. Right, so um, here, if you look at the derivative uh, two over x, and x is positive, so this guy is always positive, which means that the, this guy is increasing all the time. So this is never decreasing, increasing on the whole interval, whole domain. So we have that, right? So we got that. And a concavity, so it's a concave down all the time. So never concave upward, concave down on the whole interval from 0 to infinity. Right, so we got that. All right, then uh, we want to find the uh, correct picture. All right, so it's a concave down all the time. So it's either the first one uh, or the last one. All right, then it's, uh, let's see, uh, it's uh, increasing all the time, was it? Uh, let's, uh, let's go back and uh, what did I say? All right, so it's uh, increasing all the time. So you can see that this one's decreasing, this one's increasing, so this has got to be it. Check the answer, we got that. Alright, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.